How's it going guys? Welcome back to another Dragtoon video. This is your boy Mars. As you guys see, I have the Corolla SR5 in the background. I'm going to show you guys the full build on the car. Uh, I'm going to show you guys how to drag, race the car, uh, launch the car, and everything like that. So if everybody new to the channel, hit the subscribe button and then let's get right to it guys. So we are going to go here to the upgrades, custom upgrades, go straight to the engine conversions. And the engine conversions, they only give us one, which is a 1.6 liter inline four uh, turbo rally engine, which sounds pretty good. It has real good uh, muffles and stuff like that and the, when, it, when it downshifts and stuff. It sounds really nice. Um, that engine will give you 668 horsepower with a torque of 682 foot-pounds of torque. So you have a really nice torque there. Uh, car only weighing about 1,500 pounds. So we're going to put that engine in there. Of course, leave the car rear-wheel drive. It, that's the way it comes. It comes rear-wheel drive. Let's leave it that way and let's fully build it. So let's put everything race on here really simple, just like so. There we go. Now let's go right over here. Let's put those brakes on there. Rally suspension. Put that there. Put that there. Uh, no row cage and full weight reducted. That's how we get to the 1500 pounds. Let's go right over here. Let's fully build this part of the vehicle as well. Put all those drive lines and everything like that. There we go. Tires, of course, drag tires on the front. Leave it alone at 175. Really, really small, thin tires in the front. On the rear, we have 225s. Uh, not as wide, but it, it still does the job. And uh, just pick the lightest weight wheels you guys want. I've got these welds on there. The size of the wheels, leave them alone at 13s in the front and 13s in the rear. If you guys want to do some spacers, you guys can. I got the spacers full, spacers in the back, so it gives that aggressive uh, back end on there. Uh, you get some bumper options here to take off the uh, bumpers, which reduces the weight of the vehicle. So we're going to do that. Nothing with the spoiler, and we're going to reduce the uh, the bumper weight as well on that end as well. So that is the build. Let's go right to the tune, folks. So the tune here is a 2.6, a 0 to 64.8, 0 to 100. Uh, trapping about 207, but I haven't, uh, I don't know if I've fixed all the trapping there. Um, but here it goes guys tire pressure in the front 55 15 in the rear so we want maximum footprint in the rear grab all that grip um, here we go 220 on that final drive first gear is 225 second gear is 175 and third gear is 140 nice little three gear tune nice positive in the front we don't want those tires to barely touch the ground so we got it at a 1.5 zeroed out everything and seven 65 65 in the anti roll bars soft in the front and stiff in the rear at 380 car raised all the way up soft in the front again at 110 110 on the dampening nothing with the arrows nothing with the brakes if you guys do want to do reverse burnouts uh, without having the car spin or um, move on you you can put it towards 10 or 15 and you can do reverse burnouts and then 100 and 100 so that is the full build that is the full tune guys um, let's go take it outside real quick let's take it out for a little drive see the looks on this car so you can see it has a rally engine so it sounds like a higher pitch <laughs> love the way it sounds especially when the, on the deceleration listen to that really really nice um, the car could wheelie as well. I did do a wheelie on the track. Interior of it is all the old school interior. Really, really nice. Really, really nice. Got the car fiber doors and the hood. Let's go and take it right to the track there. Take it right to the track, guys. Just do a couple passes. See what it traps. Um, you let I don't know I probably take it to the strip too the drag strip and see what it does on the drag strip let's do some burnouts keep these tires really hot oh. to make it a wheelie I think you gotta do reverse here Really up. Alrighty, got those tires hot. 
All we gotta do is line up the front tire. There you go. Press down on the e-brake, guys. You press down on the gas. Car will hold right there on about 2,000, a little higher, 2,000. Uh, press down on the clutch on and off the e-brake. Get to about 5,000 RPMs. If you do pass 5,000 RPMs, now you definitely have to let go of the gas slowly. There you go. Get to about 5,000. You got a torque of 119 with a power of 119. Boost 73 pounds of boost. Holy crap. And uh, the car's RPM is about 5,200 RPMs at first gear. All you got to do now is let go of the clutch and the e-brake. It'll launch just like so. Transition to second and third. Really, really nice trap. About a 164, 163. Probably you can get it on a fine tune. You can probably get it to about 165. Remember, these are a nice little base tune for you guys to uh, move down the track. So remember, just burn out the tires. Press down on the e brake. Press down on the gas. Press down on the clutch. On and off the e brake. Get it to about 5,000. Let go of the clutch and the e brake. We're off. There we go. Very, very nice all around car. Um, of course, you know with the rally engine and everything like that power and everything you know everybody always wants more but you can't only fit so much in these little cars 1500 horsepower let's take it here to the track let's see what it does on the track having that first gear being really really long the car probably is going to bog on us on first gear but it should be it should be good nothing really to uh go crazy about so let's fully gas the car now see what happens kind of bogged a little bit I does like a 9 or so oh it did 8.9 so it's an 8 car 8 second car not bad not bad not bad so yeah guys all around nice little car nice little drag build for you guys hope you guys like it enjoy it subscribe hit that thumbs up and I'll see you guys around with another drag tune video peace out everybody